Come on. Drill the snakes. Perfect. Okay. You never like putting states elements on Final Fantasy games. The chances are always way too low. Yeah, you need to reduce their resistance first, don't you? Before anything. Oh, we got silver armor. Yeah, I'm gonna have to heal up. I wonder if I do a better heal. Well, that's for the whole party, I don't... Well... Hmm, might do that. Let's do it. I want to do... That on you. Right, perfect. Hey, we might save that there. Let's see who's... The silver armlet is. An armlet of worked silver. Defense 15, very nice. Where does that go? There. Oh, that's that's worse than what he's got. Can you wear this? Because you're always you're never surviving very well. I can put that onto you. Bigger defense. Okay, that should be better, shouldn't it? Um, defense 33. His defense is pretty crap as well. Could do with more of those items, couldn't we? But he's got the least hit points. 140. So he's, we definitely need him to stay alive longer. I think I've got a poll up just now for what we're playing next and at the moment final I put Final Fantasy 2 in because this is quite a short game so it won't bother me going straight on to number 2. Um, it's currently winning. <laughs> I do have two other JRPGs on there. Oh, not these guys again. Silence didn't work, so I'm not going to do that. We're just going to walk. You are going to... Did we fire at them last time? No, because there were demons. We did that. We did that one, didn't we? I wonder if we do that. Come on, that's just ridiculous. Oh, it missed. <laughs> Might have to heal up. Uh, let's let's do lightning damage. No, don't kill him. Don't you dare target anybody else except my warrior. Oh, look at the money we got. We got an antidote. Was that it? <laughs> Just an antidote. Right, um, I'm using up her heals rather than the potions.
Okay, we can't cast any more of them. Alright, let's go. Oh, I should save, shouldn't I? I might flee the next time we get those things, because... Um... Because they're just hitting too hard. And get rid of the green ones, because they poison. rid of you because you do the most damage. That's why I, um, the state settlements, Kaiser. That's why I like Final Fantasy XII with its gambit system, because you could um, you could get them to always cast like lower lower the resistances automatically. Okay, these guys are easy. Normally, let's let's go into defend mode on these guys. <laughs> That's the one I'm really looking forward to playing again. <laughs> <coughs> Although it's the Zodiac's version I'll be playing this time, so it's a bit different. So. So at least I won't really be playing the same game. <laughs> oh god. I guess we're going to have to attack them or we won't get what was in the chest. Right, silence didn't work, did it? Maybe I should just... Um, Maybe I should just defend with her. Let's do Thundara again. Don't kill my healer. That's what you get for attacking Luna. Did we get anything nice? Oh, we just got money. Um, I guess we need to heal. Have we got any heals left? No. I guess I need to use a potion up there. I think jumping between older and newer is also a good thing. One to six looks the same for an average viewer. <laughs> oh. 
We can have a think. I can post up. I did, um, did I not post a poll up previously? Oh no, I don't like these guys. We're just gonna flee. I don't like the green ones, they poison me like nothing on earth. Right, let's try and get out of here. Uh, I can't remember, it was quite a while ago. Where's, um... Yeah, it was, it was voted to play them in order. I had play them in order, put up a poll each time. Do early one, then late one, then early one, or don't care. There was six votes for playing them in order. So I will have to play them in order. Unless I accidentally forget at some point. Sophia, Veru, uh, Duller Sphere um, voted, Mitchell voted, and Arachne all voted to play them in order. So there, <laughs> there we go. We'll play them in order. I don't mind. I don't mind either way. Uh, let's let's. Uh, we need to go after the blood bones first because yeah, it's just a lot tougher. I mean, if I, if I intersperse them anyway with other other games, it won't really matter. I've got quite a few shorter JRPGs that I can play in between. Just checking a hundred. <laughs> Crazy bot. Oh, these guys hit quite hard as well. Poisoned with him. Right, I need to unpoison. Do you have an unpoison left? You do. Good morning, Dauntless. Final Fantasy is going okay so far. Apart from the poisoning. They keep poisoning me. Especially in this area. How are you this fine Friday? It's Friday today. Just gonna have to talk there, aren't we? Oh, poison straight away, look. Right, she has got no magic spells left. You've been off worth it. Uh, excuse me. You've been off work this week to get some garden work done, so of course it's rained every day except one so far. It's like that all the time, isn't it? We have been trying to get out into the garden for the past couple of weeks now, and my partner even took days off on my first week of not working 
to get out into the garden and it rained every day. It just doesn't work out, does it? We did manage to get out for a little while yesterday, but it was spitting with rain, so... But we just went with it. Yeah, it's, it's pouring here as well today. And it would be okay if it was if it was warm at the same time, but it's freezing. It's only four degrees up here today. I mean, I don't mind being in the rain if it's if it's warm. <laughs> Two shadows. Yesterday you had a dry day so the deck got ripped up and more stuff needs done so it looks like it was just need to happen on weekends. But then you've always got so much other things to do at the weekend, don't you? Mm. These guys hit quite hard but we should be okay. I'm going to put you into defend mode. Okay there. It's definitely be priority on dry days now because it's gonna be muddy mess till <laughs> Yeah, we're trying to rearrange our bottom half of the garden so that it's all vegetable land now. We had, we had some uh, three raised veg beds down there, which were here when we got the house 20 odd years ago, and they're sort of falling apart, so we're just going to take them away completely and use the whole area for vegetables at ground level. He's building a new deck and a pergola. It's going to look so good, it's it's a lot of work. Yeah, I want to build my own pergola. Um, let me just bring this back up. We bought, we bought a pergola, a metal one, and it's not very good. It just can't stand the weather up here. Um, so I want to build my own wooden one at some point. Yeah, that's that's the wet thing, isn't it? I mean, this is what we've got just now. This metal thing here, and there was a there was a cover that goes over the top of it. But with with our winds, you have to take it down every time you're not using it, or it fills up with water. <laughs> that's our seating area. Um, a bit there. I want to build my own pergola with a better roof on it. This is the veg beds, we're going to take all these away. Uh, we usually grow tatties on these and carrots. But we're just going to have this whole area as veg. So. Yours is going to be attached to the deck and up against the house, but will be massive and made of wood. Slanted roof to withstand the weather, yeah. Yeah. It's a lot better building it yourself. They charge you a fortune for these things, and they're not made very well. This one, this one bends in the wind. <laughs> I have to keep going out and straightening it up. That's how strong our winds are. Yeah, it'll it'll be worth it, won't it? That'll be good. It's, it's always much better doing it yourself, just in general, because it, it's more of a, a 
an accomplishment. Um, so, so I need to write down that we've done the marsh cave. Marsh cave. Yeah, exactly, because you're, you're so limited if you're buying. And it's hard to get things to fit in. Let's just rest up here. I mean, that's why we ended up building our own Katio, because we did look at buying a Katio, but we could never get anything that would fit properly. Did I tell you our neighbours have built a Katio now? <laughs> oh, you, oh, you, you probably can't see it here, it's over there. I wonder if I can see it from here. No. Probably can't see it at all. But they've built a katu up against the wall here for their cut. I wonder if I can find this this I got this video through. Let me see if I can get this up. Why is that not working? Try this again. Your cat has kind of stopped going outside now since she got not well. It's always safer, isn't it, when they're inside anyway. I can't play this video. I wanted to play this video. Oh there, it's working now. Uh, I wonder if I can enlarge this up. Yeah. Can I make that bigger? There. This is our neighbour's cot coming over to see Baron. Their neighbor, their their cot's on a very long lead at the moment, but it's going to be just in the cotio, their own cotio now. But this is this is their their cot over to see Baron. I'm going to go away now. <laughs> There's there was another bit of footage. Hold on, see if I can find that. Oh, there. This was another day overseeing Barn on his bed. I think she got caught up in her, her big long lead, which is why they, they've opted to set up a cartel for the cut now. I don't know if we can get... Let's see, we've got all these, so this is not where we buy level four, five spells. Okay, so we need to find that. Uh, so we need to go elsewhere. And we haven't been somewhere that does that. Right, I'm going to save there. Right, so we need to head somewhere else. Was there somewhere at the ruined place? There was, wasn't there? I, want, I need to go up there.
the Western Keep. You had to go buy a litter tray. You've never had one before. And she's using the eat. She's used it. So it's good. Some cats just are very instinctive and you have no trouble. That's Baron. Um, Luna, on the other hand, will not use a tray. And I really want to keep her in as well. We bought one of those. Um, when when Baron had to become a house cat, we bought one of those litter robots that um, empties the tray itself, uh, which has been a godsend for me because it was me that always had to empty the tray. And Baron, Baron worked out in less than a week. He was using it. He moved from using just a normal tray over to the litter robot. Yeah, I think, I'm pretty sure there's... Is there not a door? Yeah, look, there's a door over there. How do I... Oh, I need to go outside. How do I get over there? Do I have to go all the way around? The cat wouldn't use one when she was outside. You tried. It's only since she got unwell we found she started peeing on a specific spot on the bathroom floor. So you shoved a tray right at that spot and she's used it ever since. Yeah. That's uh, That's the way to do it. That's that's how I moved Barn from the the um, his normal litter tray to the litter robot. I started moving the the litter tray closer and closer to the robot, and then eventually took it away. No, oh, what are these wraiths? I think we should probably. Do you think wraiths are going to cast magic? I think they are. Um, let's lizard them. You just moved it a little and little, yeah. Cuts are pretty clever, really. They're nasty. I'm pretty sure I've got um get up to full screen. Yeah. This was Baron using his litter robot for the very first time. <laughs> I treats at the bottom as well. Yeah, I stream full time now. Uh, Tuesday to Sunday. That was, this was his existing tray down at the, the white one. And that's him having a... See, that's the old tray. I'm looking at the old tray which I hadn't... I, I, Deliberately did not empty 
so it was quite dirty. I didn't clean it out. We're going to go into the litter robot now. It's got steps. I, I bought the steps, which was an, an optional extra, just to help him up since he had his one leg. He does eventually come out, there's not a TARDIS. I think I filmed it from a different angle as well. This is 3 in the morning. <laughs> Let's speed it on a bit. There he comes, he's coming out. I'm scraping. There we go. I've used my litter robot. See, that's his dirty trailic. Oh, I'm not going to go into that. It's moved out of the way now. It's way back in the corner of the robot. How does it work? Um, once it detects the cart's left, it waits like half a minute and then the whole thing rotates. Um, and all the all the cut litter goes through a, f a filter mesh and gets stored. All the poop and everything, and the and any pee that's been sucked up into the into the litter gets dumped into a tray in the bottom, into a bag in the bottom, and then it rotates back again, and the the cleaned out litter comes back in. So you only empty it like once a week, it's, it, and it's got filters and everything on it, so it doesn't smell. So it's very good. I do, I do like it. There, there I came out again. But yeah, they're really handy if you've got in indoor cuts. We got a Falchion. Who's gonna have the Falchion? You? Yeah, definitely you. Okay, so that's the Western Keep done. Let's get out of here. So where do we need to go now? What was that place up above me? Mount oh that's the dwarf place, right. Right, so we need to head back to our ship. We'll maybe head to the start in town, do it, rest up, then head over to the dwarves. And then go to the other couple of places that we have marked. Oops, wrong way. Yeah, but basically there's no smell from those things, so it, um, you can have it sitting anywhere. They're, they're pretty big though. They take up a lot of space. Oh, I should have healed Baron up. Let me heal Baron up before he dies, before we get back to town, it costs us a fortune. Okay, let's go. 
Ooh, that's a lot of them. Can we put all of you guys to sleep? Or confuse the lot of you? Turned their backs, like. I, I'm just gonna. Def I want to see what happens. I'm going to defend. Okay, it doesn't last long, does it? And they don't hit each other for much. head up here. <coughs> uh, it was in here. There was some chests. There, right, so I need to go up, I need to go around the outside. Yeah, I was uh, made redundant, so um, I just decided to go full time streaming. Let's see how it goes. Mythical knife. Hey, we got a whole cottage to ourselves. <gasps> oh, we got the nitro powder. Right, we needed that for the dwarves. So we're. It was just as well we came here first. Wait, I forgot we'd been told that that was going to be here. Okay, equipment wise, that's another iron armor. What all did we get? Can I sort this? Um, weapons. What's custom mean? We've got a mithril knife. So that'll probably be you. No, it's not as good. Right. It's a higher accuracy, but... No. He got the silver knife, okay. The mythical knife. Okay, so he's gonna hit Hot Turner as well. Oh, I can run. I forgot I could toggle that on. I like the walking. Right. <laughs> um, so this is... Castle Carnelia. What's that over to the... 
That's the Chaos Shrine, there might be something there. For Voka, that's a town, isn't it? Let's go here first, the Chaos Shrine. How's our spells and everything doing? Hmm, I think we might rest up before we go up there. It's cheap enough here. difficult. <laughs> right, I'm, I think there was a place in here. I could be wrong. Yeah, look, there's doors in each corner. There's also big nasty spiders. Of course that was when we were only level 2. A leather cup. Oh yeah. <laughs> I think the leather cup's not going to be... Yeah, we've already got leather cups. One ghoul. Oh, I can run the holding the bead down, okay. What's a wear buster? And a gold needle. Well, a gold needle's an item. Gold needle. Cure stone. What's this one? Oh, new weapon. And let's see who can use that. Mm, it's not as good, but it might be okay for you. No. <clears throat> so why have they given us that? Maybe it's okay if I bet another class, of course. But it's definitely not better for us. Got a rune blade, okay. But it's still not better, okay. Oh, you can use it though. Hmm. Okay. 
Right, so that's that's this plate place done. This was the Chaos Shrine, wasn't it? Is this the place that I can do something in? Ketmus was telling me, I don't know if he's still here, that I missed pressing something because I presumed I couldn't. This thing. The black crystal shines ominously, the air hung in the room seems slightly distorted. So, can I not do something with that? Do we come back here later? They kept telling me I'd I, I just presumed I couldn't do something somewhere. wasn't anything at the witch's place. How do I get to the dwarf place? I need to go on the boat, don't I? Yeah, there's a dock further over. Let's go down. We definitely we couldn't go this way, could we? We couldn't get past the mountains. Okay, let's go to the dwarves. We've got the nitro for them now. The problem with the dwarven places it doesn't have an inn to rest at. You'd think the dwarves would have a pub or something. going to save before we go in. This was the, the black guy. He needed ore, didn't he? Adam and tight.
I'm just making sure I can't go off the side of the map there. Wait, there's a guy down here looking for the nitro. What's this along here? Was there a door along? Oh, there's a door here. What was in here? Oh, right. Worm killer. Ether. Ocean. Mithril mail. Money. Cottage. Great helm and a tent. So this is the dwarven place. We've done it. What's it called? Mount Doyorgar. Uh, I should put that stuff on, shouldn't I, really? Yeah, I'm just going to do optimal. He's put his great helm on. You've taken the worm killer. You didn't get anything. And neither did you. That's just dreadful. Did nobody put on the mithril mail? Did you put the mithril mail on? No, was the mithril mail not any good? No, higher evasion, but that's surprising really. Hmm. Did that swap that out? I must have hit the button by accident. Hey Super, welcome back. It's going well. Uh, we've, we're away to give the nitro to the dwarves. Nitro powder. Uh, we have two minutes until adverts. The explosive force on this powder will hain my canal open in night time flat. I owe you bairns. There we go. Now we can blast this rock to smithereens. What do you stand in the room for? What powder's going to set to blow? Unless you plan on going with it, you'd best get to it while you still can. Sorry, I changed some of the words there. Oh, what's happened? Oops. <gasps> oh no. What have the dwarves unleashed? Oh, well, Neric's happy. I can't wait to see what lies out there, beyond that canal. Okay. <laughs> I can't go that way. I need to go back up. I guess I need to go back up. I thought maybe this was going to be where it was going to blow, blow its way through. Can we look in these carts? No. Yeah. So why don't they have an inn here? We still need to get Adam and tight. Right, let me see. Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, oh, right. I've just twigged. Okay. <laughs> we can take our boat through there now. <laughs> Let's go get our boat. <laughs> I was just thinking that. Oh, I'll have to show after I do this. Hold on. It looks like Batman uh, symbol, doesn't it? Almost. A bit like it, anyway. <laughs> the little lake. The wee loch. Right, uh, I'm, before we go adventuring, I'm going to go back here and I'm going to rest up. Welcome back from the adverts. Why do we always get... Let's just electrocute a lot of them. Some nice spell effects in the game. our boat and away through the canal. Yeah, I haven't decided what I'm playing tomorrow. Um, it's either Vintage Story or Minecraft. Um, I'll make up my mind this evening. Oh, these guys are quite nasty. I think we'll just do the Thundera again, actually. Probably a bit overkill, but never mind. Right. The white mage's outfit. It's very cool looking. Isn't it? Okay, we can get through here now. I'm not sure where we're going. Where do we want to go? There's a dock. There's a dock just after this island. I'm just gonna f fly around here. For, well, sail. See if there's anything. Um. Get rid of you first. Because <clears throat> the big eyes electrocute you and stun you. Nothing up there. No. Right, let's go down here. Oh, there's a little village.
Right, where's this? We have a new town. Mel oh, this is Melmond. Now, this was mentioned. Who mentioned this? Well, I just said Melmond far to the west. Okay, we've done the nitro powder. We still need to get the Adam tight. We've done that. I haven't been to that other town yet though, have I? Should I really to open the mystic? If there was anything there, the mystic doors. This place looks a wee bit ruined. Got some old gravestones. It's a gravestone. <laughs> Never. At least we've got an inn. Restore the crystals to Grace. We keep talking about this Grace. If the earth crystal regains its glow, life will return to the earth. The hills and valleys will be green again. Okay, we're going to need lots of money for new spells. Oh, there we go. We need that one. Okay, we need life. For definite. <coughs> um, I should really take one of these. She doesn't have any of these. But for the undead. I'm actually going to take